Hey everybody, it's Blue Toad, and welcome to Super Mario Bros. A classic that has been around basically forever. <laughs> Which may, m will, will make p some people feel old, obviously. But this this game is a classic, and I really wanna I really wanna beat it because I've not ever beat it before. My cousins had this like a billion years ago. I'm sad that they don't have it anymore. Like they, they had an actual NES, but I I never got to really experience that except for when I borrowed it one time. But anyway, we basically just have to go through each world collecting coins because we only have a limited number of lives and get to the end of each level to that that's about it basically it's not extremely complicated we just have a mushroom to level us up to super mario so we have one hit point or one extra hit point and then there's also another parrot which we get if we have already ha if, if we already have a super mushroom that is which is the Fire Flower here, which allows us to actually use the B button to shoot fireballs, as we have done in every Mario game ever since, basically. Also, if we hold down the the same button, we actually, um, what's it called? We actually run, so it's actually quite helpful to have that, just active, basically. But anyway, we've got a star power from that block there. I like how simple the, this game is. It get, and yet it has so much to it, I'm not going to be able to get up there before that 1-up gets away. If we get that 1-up, that'll be good though. Because I'd need the extra lives to make sure I make it through this game. There we go, extra life. There's also another block here with a power-up in it, which we can get if we need to. Uh, I got a, uh, a sticker book from some friends uh, for like the original Mario Bros trilogy, and I think Zelda 1 and 2 or something like that, but it's it's just a cool thing to have, have because I didn't actually play these games, because it, it, it just, it gave me a feel like, this is the same thing with Link to the Past, I had uh, the instruction booklet for that mod, but not uh, an actual Super Nintendo to play the game, even though I owned it, but just being able to look at the pictures and want to play it was enough for me, basically. But anyway, let's hit this block and get another Fire Flower. I don't think I'm gonna, gonna care about score that much, but it's fine. Oh, please! And this game was the first of its kind, which means, obviously, it's gonna have some... a few things wrong with it, like the fact that Mario is slightly overlapping with the platform he's standing on. But other than that, it's it's fairly solid. And just it's crazy. <laughs> it's just crazy to think that this game has set the tone for video games for ever, basically. Okay, we need to be careful of these fire bars here. Oh, careful. Grab that fire flower. Let's keep moving and be very careful of the fire bars. Flame bars. Ah oh, no. Dodge the fire from Bowser because we're getting close to the end, or Koopa, as he was known back in the day. We just need to hit the axe at the end of the bridge, and he falls into the lava. Thank you, Mario! But our princess is in another castle! The joke that nobody will ever forget. The princess is always in another castle. Anyway, let's keep moving on to the world 2 now. Doing pretty well. I really wanted to play, um, what's it called? Super Mario Bros. 35, but I wasn't able to play it before it was removed. And I really wanted to come back out again or something, just because I want to play it and experience the chaos that is this game, but against 35 or 34 other people. I'm trying to go against the chaos, just all, all the enemies and stuff on the screen. Also, there's this spring here that we don't actually... Like, you don't even actually know that much about, about it, because it's, it's such a throwaway thing. But this spring here actually springs us up all the way over here. I just think it's the, the spring is very forgettable and I want to I want to draw more attention to it because it's actually impressive. So just yeah. Anyway, let's go down this pipe. 
And we should be underwater now, so let's just go ahead and keep jumping and shooting fireballs, basically. Seems like a good plan. Need to be careful with the bloopers. The bloopers, like in any other Mario game, will actually... Uh, try and be on Mario's level, which means if you're underneath them, they shouldn't be able to get you. But still, you probably want to avoid them. Also, what's impressive about this is there's also a few areas like this, where there's actually a current pulling you Mario down faster the more down he is. Which is actually really cool. Because, like, just remember, this is an NES game. But anyway, let's touch this pipe and teleport in, because that's basically how it works underwater. Normally, Mario just sinks into the pipe, but underwater, the pipe just teleports him in. But there we go. Another, another level down. I feel like I'm doing pretty well. I, w I would have died by this point normally. So I don't know what's happening, but anyway, I'm definitely gonna die in this stage because I'm 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 just too quick with this stage. I try and perfect jump every platform while running, which is not the way you should do it, especially when you get to a specific point in the stage, which is over here where there's spread out platforms, and you really don't want to mess that up. So that's where I would have died, but I think I should be good now. So up to the next castle. So let's see what this next one has for us. There's also shortcuts in some of the levels that allow you to go to later worlds a lot earlier, if you want to. But I'm going to avoid those for now, and I'm going to come back and show those, if I can. I don't know where they all are. I know where the first ones are, because it's a very memorable location. Also, if you get hit by anything in Fire Flower form, you go back to regular form, where you only have one hit point left. So having a Fire Flower doesn't really give you an extra hit point, like it does in future games, which is interesting. It's definitely a good thing that they allowed the extra hit points later on. Although there is a glitch that I might be able to pull off, maybe, probably not, that allows Mario to be basically five Mario, but also not five Mario, and he has like plenty of hit points. Not. I don't know, but he has he has some extra hit points when you do that glitch. But anyway, that's World Two complete. You can also play this uh, in two player. Technically, it's not really two player. It's it's more of a versus mode, where one pl person plays as Mario, and then when that person dies, it's Luigi's turn. Or I think when you clear a stage, possibly, it also swaps. But it, you take turns, and whoever makes it the furthest wins, I guess? I don't know. But anyway, let's grab this mushroom. Because I really need it. I really don't know much about the later worlds. I have played to, like, World 6 or something like that. But I, I really don't remember, because it's been a while. Also, I remember that my cousins actually had two copies of the game. One of the copy of the game had, like, an actual like, working sky, and the other one didn't for some reason. Like, the all the blue skies would just not be... blue for some reason. That would be like this screen. And I don't know why that is exactly. But anyway, let's see if I can find another power-up. I don't actually... I really don't know <laughs> what I'm doing. Okay. Also, if you, ha if you haven't seen... <laughs> um, custom Mario Maker, made by the fans, uh, it's very interesting because it has a lot built into it that I really appreciate, like using the blocks the way they weren't intended to be used in this style, basically, but like with an actual background and it's really cool. You should you definitely check that out. Uh, I hope to, I hope I can play something like that at some point, but I really don't know. Okay, let's grab this, which I believe is a fire flower. That's not what I thought it was. I thought it was a star. I might be thinking of somewhere else. Please grab that, thank you. Mario Physics. Also, I think maybe this is what I think. Yes, it is. Grab that star power. Go through anything we can. We don't get 1-ups for killing a lot of enemies, though, so... At least I don't think so. I might just be bad at the game, but anyway. We just get lots of points. And it depends... The, po the points depend on who we take out. Also... The top of the flagpole does not give us an extra life, I do not believe. It just... I think the most you can get on the flagpole is 5,000 points. 
also forget the the time at, when we hit the flagpole to be double numbers, basically double the same the same number twice. I believe we get the fireworks, which I don't know what that like actually like. I don't think that does anything. I might be wrong, but it's cool that that's there. I'm pretty sure that's how that works, at least. Okay, got another one up. Nope, you can't jump underneath those platforms because they just act as a, they're they're a roof basically. Well, there goes that one up I just got. Need to be careful with my platforming. I didn't have this much trouble last time I went through this level, so I don't know why I'm struggling so much. Maybe I didn't make it through this level. I'm pretty sure I made it through this level because I remember this platform. Yeah, that's the end. Okay. World 3 Castle, let's go. I love how simple this game is, except it, it's- and it's set- Even if- even though it's simple, it's- it's- it's impacted the rest of the gaming world so much. Okay. I mean, it impacted the gaming world when it came out, so... And even now, it's still impacting the gaming world, I think. It's just impressive at how simple it is, except it- and it- it- It's- it's so simple, and except- except it's also... So interesting. But there we go. That's World 3 complete. And I'm not dead yet. But the princess is in another castle, so... And there's still plenty more time to die. Especially if I'm running at full speed. Oh no, I don't think I made it this far. Last time I played through here, okay. Well, maybe I did, I don't know. I've played- definitely played this level at some point. But not recently. But we have... Lakitu, ah, uh, who's throwing spinies at us. And this is just pain, so... I'm probably gonna die in this world. Okay, just run. Just run. Just ignore everything and run. Run for your life, Mario. Hey, he, ha, oh. E nope, that was a dumb idea. I don't know why. I, I don't know what I thought was going to happen. <clears throat> well, that's fine. We have an invisible checkpoint because that's a thing. Here, here, here. I really want whole oh, a mushroom. Thank you. Well, there it goes. Short lived. It's fine. Just need to make it a little bit further because this is the end. Just like that. Maybe you can get high on the flagpole, I'm just bad at it. Because the, mom the momentum is really difficult to get going. But there we go. Reach the second level of this world, which looks like it's going to be underground. I think possibly all of the underground levels have secret exits. Possibly. I might be wrong about that. But I think that might be what it is. Oh, hello. Ow, no, I couldn't bounce high. It's fine. <laughs> it's so fine. Just give me another mushroom, please. I like how the the edge of these blocks have blue on them. Also, hang on, that's a bit rude. Nope. I was hoping that I could still jump on it, if it even if it wasn't on screen. But I don't know how I'll get that otherwise. Oh, game over. Uh, well, that's not good, because we met halfway through, kind of, not quite. Well, that's okay, because if we hold down A, and press start, we start at the beginning of the last world we cleared. Or well, we made it to, so. We have to go back a bit every time we die. We lose all of our coins and score, but at least we can keep going from where we're up to, so. It's not the, the real way to play, but it's fine. It's the way that I'm going to play, because I will not make it through every world without dying. Oh boy. Hang on. Nope. I am going to die a lot. <laughs> I never said I was good at this game. In fact, I'm pretty sure I said I wasn't good at it at all. So, it's fine. Just let me hit that, and then make it across this gap. Grab that, and don't jump into the... the prana plant. Okay, there we go. Good. Now I might actually be able to get a fire flower and actually be able to do better. I'm glad I made it to World 4 before dying. 
That was a lot further than I thought I'd get. And of course, if you're not doing the hold A and press start trick to go back to where you, the last world you're in, you can also use the shortcuts to get back up to the world you're in. But you won't, you still won't have the score, so. Let's go up on top, because we can. We can do this in the first world as well. But it allows us to skip quite a lot. Like, quite a lot. Although I think now that I'm up here, I might need to go down, otherwise I will go to the secret exits. Which basically the secret exit has three pipes. And... Or two pipes, I think, sometimes. Or maybe one pipe. A, a very... A pipe... One, one to three pipes. Which will take you to a, a future world. That's all you need to know. I just need to remember that this was World 4 that had the... This other pipe secret thing. Okay. Made it a little bit further. Whoop. Careful. Very careful. I don't think I can make... Jumps good. Well, maybe I can. Okay. Another fire flower. I like these weighted platforms that go... Ha, ha, ho. Um... I have made horrible decisions. I have made horrible, horrible choices. I like those platforms that are way... Wait, if it's fine. Okay. Let's try this again. That's better. I might be actually getting better at the game. Doubtful, but possible. Need to make some of these jumps good. Okay. There's a lot of coins this level, and I think there's also, a, uh, sometimes, uh, secret areas, like in the sky or something, which just have a bunch of coins for you to get. I think there's one that I actually missed already in one of the previous worlds, because there's a, a vine that comes out of a, a, a brick block for you to get. Let's go up. I have a feeling that this is gonna want me to go the right way. Possibly. Or possibly it's just a different set of ways to go. Uh, down? It was probably actually middle. Ah! Pain. It's fine. I think if we go the wrong way though... Actually, I made it through. Yeah, if we go the wrong way, we're in trouble. But anyway, I died anyway, so it doesn't matter. And I got a game over, which means I have to go back to the beginning of the world. Ah, <sighs> if only I was better at video game. Okay. <laughs> I believe that I can get back to where I died. I don't really know, though. Just need to run. I really hope that one of these pipes just has a underground section. Thank you. Get some more coins. And I think this is a coin block here, which means they'll just have a bunch of... Nope. It's just a power-up. Okay. But sometimes there can be a coin block, which will just have a bunch of coins in it. Okay, we're at... The end, I think? Yep. Oh, amazing. <laughs> that was great momentum, but I didn't get the top of the flagpole, if that is possible. But anyway. Boom. One firework. <laughs> Okay. I'm tempted to take the shortcut, but I really shouldn't because I want to see each world, basically, right now. Also, I love the design that they took for all the items in the game. Like the fire flower, the mushroom. Just something about it is satisfying to me. Like the coins. I love the way that the coins, like, glow in that way. Or flash. Just that... Yeah, some, something about it is good. It's well done. Get rid of you. We can also grab the coins that are above the brick blocks when we break them. Grab all these. Careful. Careful, 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 careful. No, I'm in trouble now. That's okay. Just need to live a little bit longer. Okay. 
Okay. Also, if you haven't seen Super Mario Bros. with portals, you have not lived. Because basically, you can just- oh, you can just build so much momentum off of it to just- if You should see a TAS speedrun with Mario with portals, Super Mario Bros. with portals. It's- it's good. It's really good. Hey, please. I don't want to die again. I have to make it to the next world, at the very least, because then... Then I can continue... My journey... Without having to worry about dying that much. Also, the flashing is really... Not good, but that's just a limitation... Of having so many things on the screen, probably. Or just bad coding, because it's possible that that's just... I don't know what the thing I'm trying to say is. But like, if it was trying to draw at the wrong time, I need to I need to go up. I went down. It's fine. I'll just go back through again or something. Can't go down there. Duck. Oh, ducking is, seems very difficult for some reason. Is this the same or is this the different? This is the same. Okay, because we went the wrong way, we have to go back through. It's actually impressive that they did that. Okay, so now... We want to go down. Carefully. But I, I have a lot of trouble with the ducking because it doesn't really duck when I, like, when I hold it down, it just doesn't hold down. Okay, careful. Careful, 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 careful. There's a lot of stuff here now. But I made it. We've made it to World 5. Which is good because now I don't go back to the beginning of World 4 again. Thank you, Mario, but our princess is in another castle! I have two lives, I'm not gonna make it. I like the... the colouring of these, like, trees though. Whatever they are. Makes it feel like a, a snow world, but it's not actually a snow world. Like, even with the pipes as well, being... silver, I guess, I don't know. It adds so much. Ooh, star power, okay. Grab that. Oh, and we also have the introduction of bullet bills now. So we need to be careful of that. Also, I believe... No? Then not. Huh, I fell. I didn't jump. Okay. I don't know why I didn't jump. I. <laughs> it's fine. Okay, we need to be careful. Very careful. So careful. Okay, I think I do want to go up here though, because this we can go down, I remember. But what? Oh, coin block. Okay. It's probably worth every coin block being used to its full ability. Just because coins can give you some extra lives. So, might as well. Okay. Also, something I'm proud of is that my mum actually beat this, so... Now I want to beat it. Carry on the legacy. Okay, 5-2. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. I love bullet bills and springs and coopers. Oh boy, it's fine. Oh, and oh, hammer bros, hammer bros. Let me tell you. Oh, it's underwater as well. Okay. I feel like I've made mistakes. I feel like I've made horrible, horrible mistakes. I've made terrible mistakes. Please don't be dead. Oh, dead. Ah, <sighs> it's fine. Let's just hold A, press start, and we're back to the beginning of World 5. We have a few lives to work with now. It's a shame those coins I collected with the co from the coin block didn't mean anything, though. Oh, there is a block there. Why wasn't it spawning in before? That's what I was trying to do. I knew there was a- I knew there was one up there. Because there are invisible blocks sometimes, but I guess the- the physics in this doesn't make a lot of sense for it, so... That's fine. Because I'm noticing that, like, some of the textures sometimes overlap, and it's weird which ones do and which ones don't. Like, the pipe textures... You wouldn't think that those would be different parts of a thing, but maybe it is. Maybe the way it's drawing is really weird. 
Like, the- every color or something is like a different thing being drawn. I doubt it, but it's possible. Okay, back in 5-2. Oh boy. That was close, close, very close. Oh boy, please. How come you can overlap with the block, but I can't? It's fine. Hammer bro. Okay. I am playing this dangerously. I'm even playing more dangerously now that I'm in here. I should have just gone the outer ways. Oh, go up. And then go down. And go up and down. Duh. The, 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 the fish were in different positions. That's interesting. Can I please have... Something? No. Okay. Not quite. Okay. But, 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 you, you turned around! He turned around. It's fine. Oh boy, you're there, and you're there. I don't like you being there. Okay, it's fine. Oh, coin block and a mushroom. Oh, the mushroom's gone. Okay. Yeah! Yeah! Okay, I'm fine. Oh, so fine. So fine. So fine. Okay. Just need to make this jump. We've made it to the third level. Oh my gosh. We have another level and then the castle level. And I can't die three more times in that time. Oh, random bullet bills. I love random bullet bills. I remember this level, for some reason. Unless I'm confusing it with a different level. No, I, I do remember this level. I definitely remember this level. And I don't know why exactly, but I do. Scrap that. Mushroom. Thank you. It's been so long. Ha, 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 ha. Oh my goodness, random stuff everywhere. Why? It's fine. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay. I'm doing all right. <laughs> Somehow. Okay. End castle, let's go. Oh. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. We're gonna get this first try. No deaths. Oh, that's a big flame bar. Okay. Let's go up. Take our time. Just go slow. Just go slow. Just go slow. Take your time. It's all good. Oh, I don't like this. Just take your time. Oh, oh take, take your time. Take your time. Take your time. Take your time. Okay. This is also a, a previous castle, I'm pretty sure, just with more stuff in it. Which does make sense. It means that they can store a lot more without actually storing more. Okay, that's fine. I was really hoping to actually make it to the thing, but okay with the thing, but now we have made it to world 6 and we still are alive. <laughs> with some extra lives. And now if we die, we go back to the beginning of world 6. Let's grab all this. Oh, mushroom, I need. Thank you. And I want to avoid this lack too. I'm glad that we can run over one block gaps. I'm so glad we can run over one block gaps. Okay, that's fine. I'm okay with this. I can't believe I'm still alive. <laughs> like, even, even though I'm restarting at the beginning of some of these worlds, I can't believe I'm still alive. I can't believe I made this far.